Hello, today we're going to go over a basic toilet ins installation. Um, we're going to start off with, uh, I got my wax ring cleaned off already from a previous install. Uh, you want to make sure you get everything cleaned up good and all the old debris off. Uh, I prefer to take the wax ring and stick it on the toilet. Now some people prefer to go ahead and place it in the flange first, but I found that this way is more uh, easier, less prone to errors, uh, and, and just generally easier for me, but that's your personal preference. So once, once you take this wax ring and kind of twist it and embed it to the porcelain there, make sure it's stuck good, because the last thing you want is for it to fall off when you, when you go to set your toilet. I got my T-bolts placed already, uh, so next step is I want to take my toilet, and it's easier if you have two people, but, but for this demonstration I'm going to use one. And kind of be careful. Make sure you're centered over your flange and you got your T bolts lined up coming through the holes. Everything looks good there, so I'm going to go ahead and just use my body weight. Kind of gently press down on this toilet and get that wax seated in good and smooshed, and smushed down evenly. And it looks like we're in pretty good shape there. Okay, so after you got your toilet set, uh, got your wax ring smashed down pretty good. You can do your final drawdown uh, then uh, by placing your bolt caps and your, and your metal washer. Mm -hmm. Notice on your bolt caps, most of them have uh, on the base which side goes up. Just pay attention to that. Place your metal washer over top. Screw the nut down. And take a ratchet or wrench, whichever you prefer. Kind of just slowly draw down. Key here is not to get in a hurry. Go small incremental steps. And you'll see the toilet finally smashing down those final increments. Now I'm pretty confident that that's tight. Now some people prefer, <clears throat> you'll notice your bolt cap won't go over top of this studs. Some people prefer uh, hacksaw. Uh, I like to use bolt cutters because it's just easier and simpler. Um, but either way is fine. Main thing is just to uh, gain clearance for that bolt cap to fit. You can snap your bolt cap on and you're done. 